What's up guys and welcome back, we're here with part 17 of our Rome 2 Emperor Divi Empire Divided campaign. Girl, that was a mouthful I tried to put in there. I'm Pope John Paul and, well, we've got two settlements left for Gallic Rome and we're about to take one undefended. I think the other one has a small legion and a fleet and then we can get rid of when we destroyed them. Gallic Rome is gone and all of these damn agents that we've had troubles with in the last few episodes will all die as well. Our campaign into uh, Spain also is going very very well. We are pushing through very nicely. I am going to push on I think. I'm just going to go straight down to here because we just can and it's undefended. I don't know where the Spanish legions are. Maybe dead hopefully. But yeah we're in good times now. The economy is looking good and uh, the empire is strong, so we will quickly wrap up the rebe rebels, remake the uh, borders of the empire, and then it's a job well done. And I'm getting random messages. Thank you. I'll get rid of that. So we'll destroy that, and then we are good to go. Uh, yeah, we've got a lot of a lot of uh, money now currently, but we need we need more. We need more. So I'll end the turn. I think. Unless we've got... Oh, we've got upgrading that he's doing. And then we are good to go, I think. Um, banditry. Or have we got one that brings down money? Upkeep for land units. Excellent. We'll do that. Sorts out our money. Well, not money problems, but... Upkeep cost is high. Um, yeah, in the last episode, we uh, already had to fight some eastern armies. Which we didn't have... Um, Unfortunately, we didn't fight uh, in the on the video, but we will have many battles against the Sassanids, I'm sure, before the day is out. We've got one, two, three, four. I think that is part of it. Four to take back. Yeah, Palmyra. And then, uh, and then we're good. And we could march on Sister Fion. Depends on just on the campaign, really, just if we get there, if we uh, feel like we need to go there. But, um, oh, Gallic Rome has a fleet just la randomly in the in the uh, ocean. Oh, dear. Um, but, yeah, I think we're ready to end the turn. Ooh, could we march this one finally forward? I think we could. We'll march it forward. Oh, and we found a legion now. The 10th Equestrius. Uh, not 10th. 3rd Equestrius. Very nice. Yeah, you all, you've moved. You've not moved, but we could recruit. No, we can't because we have no money. Okay, well, we'll end the turn then. We'll see what happens on the other side. Gallic Rome moving some forces around. Looking like it's ready to defend. One last time, all its agents moving. It takes forever. Sassanids are doing some things. How dare they? That's an act of war. Oh. Oh, I shouldn't have moved. Because new... Uh, not new media. Um... Lusitania was here. I was just not looking. Well, we're not going to win that, so that's unfortunate. Oh well, I made a mistake and I paid for it. But we'll uh, we'll bounce back. Oh, and another Lusitanian army. Egypt wants me to join in a war against Moreau. Yeah, sure. Moreau's down there. They they can do whatever. Moreau wants peace treaty. What are you going to give me? In return, are you going to become a client state? Oh, they nearly did. I could have made them a client state. That would have been interesting. Uh, they are marching very, very far. Um, you want me to join in a war against Media? Um, I've got enough of a hand at the moment with um, Maori. No, I've got no armies there at the moment, Glacier. I'm sorry. I, I, my vassals must hate me. Oh, and the Vandals have declared war on me. Oh, I might need to raise a legion in the uh, in the east again. What legion is even near? None of them. Yeah, I'm gonna have to raise a legion here. Um, I will raise it. Istros mm. or Grenev? Or is it here in Grenev? Um. Which one? I don't think either of these are uh, my dynasty. No, obviously not Aurelian dynasty. Patrici Council and very Patissium and the, I'll do the Patrici Council. Have I got like an heir? Oh, I have this guy. He's a general in 
the Bracte. Um, and he's got kids. Can I adopt? I'd like to adopt someone. You. Oh, he's from a different party. I can't adopt. Can I adopt him? I can. Other nobles. He's doing really well. Or him. I'll get Publius Floris. So he's, in, he's now part of my family. Let's do it. We need, we could do with more, uh, more, I don't know, influence will go with improved relations, secure promotion. Can I do anything else? Can I make him seek a spouse? I can. Who's he got married to? Ooh, her. Okay. Zeal, um... You've got everything. You're not going to help with having that. You're not going to lead an army either. Um, have children, yeah. Um, you're not going to have any of these. I don't know. Um, just have authority, why not? Um, cunning. Just have cunning. I don't know why. Why not? Um, but yes, we will raise an army in... Oh, I could build this, I guess. We've also... That was supposed to help with corruption, but it's not really helped too much, I don't think. Economy, obviously, we've gone down, but we've not... Like, economy helps a bit, but it's not actually, like, giving you boosts to, like, what you invest in and stuff like that. I actually haven't done that one. I skipped it out. Um... Might go down some military stuff. Probably should go down some military stuff. I bet these probably help with... Actually, no, they don't. None of these help with uh, upkeep. Heh. Yeah. This one might. No, it actually doesn't. I'm going to do that one anyway. I'm going to just get the better, better barracks because we're just getting to that late game and I'm just, I'm ready to do it. Anyway, we're going to raise you. The Patrici Council will give you... You're not the cheapest bodyguard. Oh, uh, well you are, actually. You just look very fancy. Dialis, yeah, sure. Have that name. That seems pretty cool. Um, yeah, you can upgrade that. Um, and we will give you... Um, I will give you just spam out a load of levies. Um, and then we'll give you a little, oh, not Bale Eric Slingers. Oh, we don't have any other Slingers though. Oh, what's annoying. And you've got really good spears. I will definitely use them over any, over any anything else. Because they're really good. Oh, they're really good as well. I can wait. I can wait. We've not got, oh, we've got archers. I might get Germanic Hunters for him. We'll see. Um, and then we will... Build grain pits. Squalor is okay here. Squalor can... Yeah, we can do that. Um, I will also... I mean, it probably won't reach in time to like help uh, currently, but this legion will go back. It's It's got business now over here. I don't know, actually. It's very near Eostros. It might reach. Um, yeah, have bonuses for your horsemen. Go for it. Um, it doesn't give us much money left. Let's just kill you off. 95. Excellent. Right, so we kill another army. And then we need to go and deal with Lusitania, which we might have a battle there. Augusta. Excellent. And destroy and... Oh, actually, no. Well, we could convert. Convert and then somewhere over here there is something they needed changing. One of these. I swear I had something that I was destroying or converting over here. Hmm. Let's look on here. Settlement lost, obviously. Oh, is it um in down here? Is it down here? It was. Oh, it's gonna have to be a religious gathering. And I've got far too many of these. Where are all these then? Abusus. Abusus definitely doesn't need one. Nova Carthago. 
I'm gonna destroy the one there and I will build a religious gathering. Hmm. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do it that way. Um, where's that legion? This legion's here. 2020. I'm going to siege. We have good odds. Um, and I'm going to surround for now. And I'm going to bring this fleet in to help. Now it makes it even better odds. Get the blockade set up. And then we shall assault here. Excellent. We shall assault and we shall be victorious. And we will take back Saguntum, which they took from us in Genov. How rude of them. Hi guys and welcome back. I did a bit of a shortcut there because it was taking a little while just to load in and uh, so I'll just have to check up on that later and make sure that there's nothing wrong with the, uh, the game basically because it shouldn't be loading in that slowly. But anyway, I went and set up the army for us and we've got um, more, we've got all our Roman levies in like the front line with vigilates on the flanks to protect from cavalry. Uh, missiles in the front, uh, we've got cohorts in reserve and all the cavalry out here ready to fight anything that comes in the plains. And then the fleet should be arriving over here somewhere. So we'll uh, start and we'll see what happens. So my fleet is coming in over here. Our reinforcements have arrived. Yes, they have. And they're going to run for the... They're going to run for the um, beaches, I imagine. They don't want to engage. So if we can get nice up here, that'd be nice. And then... Army, we will just... Oh, they do actually look like they'll fight just out here. Interesting. I will move up to here. They look like they're just happy just to like stand here. This is a very strange formation. But I'll take it. They've got a lot of these Iberian swords. Well, they're mercenaries as well. They've got quite a few Roman levies. The Roman levies are probably their only match to most of my infantry. But they have got no cohorts. The equites are all over here, interestingly enough. And the general is way off over there. So anyway, we'll uh, fast forward while this, this happens. I was just saying before um, in recording, and I did not expect you to cut, I was just saying um, thank you for everyone that subbed and uh, liked the videos and stuff. The support is amazing. I'm really appreciating it. Did not think at this point in doing YouTube I'd be at 180-something subs. It just never crossed my mind. I was really expecting... Uh, to take a lot longer to grow but um, if you haven't already subbed and you're enjoying the content please do the support really does help and um, and yeah we'll just we'll get on with the, uh, the battle basically I think I'm gonna I'll slow it down now I think I'm gonna send in all of the missile um, which is literally like every boat to just shoot them because hell I can. I also have a lot of support probably just from doing that on... Go over there. Can I not land over here? Can I not land? I was going to say. Just go and land. So we'll go and uh, shoot all these cavalry up. Look, we've already killed about half a dozen. Oh, maybe more than that now. Doing a lot of damage. Everyone just like, every single one of you just shoot this, these guys here. You've got a lot more protection than they do. At least I'd hope you do. You're like in. You're going to just stand there and shoot. Oh, that is nasty. They're just going to, okay. They're just going to try and charge at me in the water. It's an interesting tactic by the AI, but I uh, respect it. Respect the ba bravery of these men, and just like that, we just broke a unit. So how dumb is the AI today? And we're breaking quite a few of their units. And now another cavalry unit is just going to like charge stupidly into the formation. Very strange. This is really strange. I think I've broken the AI, just because it's just like. 
They're just like, how dare you throw stuff at us? Just keep killing these guys. Why would I? I'm not going to disembark. I'm just going to keep shooting you. Um, the general keeps shooting. And there we go. We've, we're you slowly getting through all the ammunition. Which ones stop using ammunition out of this boat lot then? Um, you. You go and disembark over there. Just go and join the main army. Uh, go and disembark. Go and join the main army. You've also used all your stuff, so go and disembark. You join the main army. Excellent! I'm just on like a parrot there. Well, not a parrot, I don't know, just a mad person. Just repeating everything I'm saying, right? Everyone just go over there, I think, apart from like this guy and this guy. But no one can get out. Are you going anywhere? Uh, you should, because you've used all your ammo. Everyone's. You've not used any of your ammo. Come back here. You should be going somewhere, though. Just start shooting this guy. Oh, we're going to have like a nice little collision going on there. Oh, it's looking good, isn't it? Just like killing these guys left, right, and center. No trouble at all. Just get out. We don't need to disembark anyone here. Well, this is going to be a. Well, not a simpler battle, but it's going to be certainly easier. With this. But hey, we can live with it. Just keep volley! I'll have a volley! Volley, please! Oof! The lime green and yellow uniforms certainly make you very easy to pick out, I am gonna just admit. Oh, some nasty volley. Oh, into the back there! There's been at least 20 guys that died. Can you can you hit them? Yeah, yeah, they're annoying me. Are they making a? Uh, they're not even making a push. So you've all used your ammo as well, so we might as well just keep you at the back as like a awesome skirmishing force, if needs be. There we go. Just keep just keep doing your thing. Um, keep shooting this. They're just gonna keep putting. A missile un um melee units here just to get killed. Well, that's fine. Oh, it's nasty. Look at the pile of dead men already here. Dead men and horses. And these guys just aren't learning. I must have like already won the battle because I've killed. A I've broken about five or six units. Oh, the eagle's fallen. The standard bearer fell. No. Someone pick up the eagle for the glory of the unit. Ah, ah well. Onwards. Which one of you used all the ammo? Oh, both of you. Excellent. Well, you can both go over there. You're like not needed anymore here. Goodbye. Now for the main army. Now for the main army. We're gonna move here. We're gonna start doing things. Bring the cavalry up to here. Um. The support infantry guys, they can just stay at the back and just, they can just do whatever. By your command. Um, yeah, most of these vigilates are a bit beaten up. Oh, certainly this flank. We could definitely, I might do a push here. Might bring the cohorts across, do a push down here, and go straight in the back. We're already skirmishing over here as well. I hadn't realized. Oh, these vigilates are beaten up as well. Slingers, you, yeah, you might as well just start softening them up. Um, go in and go in. Who are you? Oh, I bring swords. You can push in there. You push in here. Excellent. We should be doing just fine. We're going to keep you in reserve because you take forever to reinforce if you die. I should just... Right, you just go in. Just go in. Your skirmishes, you take. You've got a long. I'm gonna just. Actually, no, just just go in. At speed, indeed. Oh, and you just broke! Wow. Let's let's watch this uh, charge. 
Oh, oh, they javied into the side of my men. Inward, inwards, onwards. Follow the eagle and the man with the, the, the lion on his head. He is a, a great man. He must have killed that lion if he's got that on his head. They don't just give them out as uniforms. Clearly not. They don't just do that. Don't be silly. Um, you carry on this way and keep pushing in there. You go into the back here. Um, bring up some missiles to support and another sword. Well, bring these guys as like just flanking guys. I I don't know. They just they're just here. You can help hold. Oh god, we got more. Just go over there, guys. Come on. Are you ask. Do you making me come over here? The viewers are wanting to watch the battle. Look what you're doing. Look what you're making me do. That was awful. That was awful of them. How could they? Okay, you're getting very. Very isolated. Uh, you need to push. Um, you go in there. Keep pushing. And push. Right. Okay, they're just actually retreating, which is nice of them. Oh, they're actually going to break just before we even get in there. Wow, that's nice of them. I really thought this unit was done for. Oh, actually, they've, they've just rallied. Oh, how annoying. Um, you come over here because we want to reinforce and maybe try and get around the back. Um, you guys just like to throw in if needs be. You're also just all to throw in if needs be. And we'll just keep the rest of the army here. It's not much, but actually we could probably push through. They've like got nothing left. They've literally thrown everything to the other side because of that push by me. Oh, it's like it's like I planned this. I really didn't. Okay, you need to stop. You need to stop. Yeah, go through there. Oh, we're going to get some nasty volleys here. Um, go for them, slingers. I don't know why they're breaking so quickly. They really should... Oh, actually, no, go in there. You're going to get slaughtered otherwise. Um, you go back there. Kill them all. Um, you should just hold your position. And you all just get thrown in. Go die with glory. All push on this unit. All push. All push. They are indeed. Go away. I thought I turned Discord off. And yet they still hound me. Right. Cavalry's just not needed. Um, you just might as well just come up. Oh, we've got breaking unit. Oh, it's a vigilate that I for forced into square. Okay. Um, we might need to send... One of the sword units in the other way. I'm not sure. Because all of these skirmishes are going to break. Including. I don't know. They might be okay. They're broken. Where are the cavalry for the enemy? They're not actually anywhere, so I might just go for there. All go down here, please, though. Thank you. Thank you. Right. Um, just charge in. This fleet can be remade. You're getting crushed. Can you just, like, join in this fight here, please? Yeah, they're actually now holding their own a bit. After f early gains... Okay, you came back. You're needed on this flank. Excellent. Right. I think we've got this. Oh, right, get these guys. Um, charge the general. Charge the general. Charge the general. Um, one of you aim over here. One of you aim over here. Actually, yeah, just both aim there. That was easier than I thought. Horse archers, do your thing. Um, we'll have a quick look down here, see what's going on.
Looks like we're winning all right. Can't really see a lot. Let's get out of this. Let's have a look over here. Yeah, this is better. We can see the good lines of infantry. Yeah, I told him to get it. go under attack, you idiots. Now let's have a look at the blood and gore. Beautiful. I'm liking the purple shields of uh, their soldiers. It reminds me of the Praetorian Guard a bit. But the oval shields, they are... Woo! They are fine. That's where it's at. Alright, any guys in the back here that should really be in combat? Yep, yeah, you, and yes, you. Keep shooting at them. You keep shooting at them. Excellent, right. Enemy general dead. Charge into the back of these guys. And you just cap this. It should be no time now until we break this army. And we already are. Excellent. Oh, the Kohors wasn't even in combat. Brilliant. Right. Swing in. Murder these guys. Just murder them. Murder. Oh, some good... Some good kills there. Look at all those guys. You're not getting up. You're not getting up. You're not getting up. It's not a problem if they use their ammo up. We're killing them all. Just the whole army just killing them all. There we go. This is going to be a nice massacre. We don't even need to fight on because we will kill them because it's a settlement. It's a close victory. Yeah, I guess so. There's a few units that like cause it to be a close victory. There's a few units which I definitely like left to die. But hey, that's the sacrifice you have to do sometimes. And hopefully uh, we we win. We win. Of course we won. There we go. We, were, we killed them all. And we now get more experience with my army. And then we get this place back. Hey, we have 29 food. Jeez. Um, I'm going to put... We've got enough food to last us forever now, really. What's the squad like here? Oh, it's... Minimal. <laughs> it's the word I'm going to use. It is minimal. Um, I don't know. That one gets minimal food, but that one... I'm going to do the lives a uh, herding ground. Let's use the rest on that. And then we're going to try and put this navy back into port over here. So try and help support in this siege that I inevitably will have. Oh, they get Evocati as generals. I wish I got Evocati as generals. Um, We keep going to Talentum now. Which I'm... Oh, yeah. That's just... It's always good to see an unoccupied settlement... Execution. Decisive victory indeed. Faction destroyed. That's Hispania Soteria gone. Wow. After all the problems they gave me in those earlier episodes. Gone. No longer a problem. Wow. What units do you give? Oh, Balex Slingers, obviously. Iberian Cavalry. Hmm. Interesting. Auxiliary Scutieri. They're actually quite good. They actually might be a useful mercenary unit. I mean, most of the German ones also are fairly good. Don't tell them I said that, though. They'll never get over it. No, you can't. No, so you might as well just stay in Trevorum. Augusta, you're, you've you you've upgraded for just standing, uh, for taking an unoccupied settlement. Good job. Good job. Um, we're just going to give you keeps of the peace. Keepers of the Peace is always good. Oh, and you... Yeah, you've moved. Um, of course, yeah, so you've moved. Of course, um... Dacia... Dacia... I could take Antioch. It's doable. Lyrica hasn't moved and it has to stay there. So I think everyone else has moved. The ample amounts. We can upgrade you. Excellent. We will end the turn and see what happens. Gallic Rome.
pulling back one last time. No, I don't want to play Imperator Rome, thank you. Go away. Literally the most annoying thing. Discord pop-ups. Um, main. Yeah, go for it. None of your, none of your ar armies are near me. Moreau, are actually doing any damage to you? Oh, they, they might actually. Can you... I think Egypt's bitten off more than it can chew in, like, wars. I might need to send an army. I might need to send an army in from Karenka and just, like, help them out. Yeah, they, they just lost, like, a load of territory there. Idiots! And I'm going to lose territory. And I don't think I garrisoned the right one. Plague in somewhere. Oh, here. Consulting the Sibylline books. How bad's the plague? Okay. It's pretty bad. Um, Frumentary? Gives food, tax. This one also gives tax. It takes food. This one also gives public order. This one does a bit of both. I might just do Quaster. Do a Quaster. Um, Alliance Forge, Bosphorus and the Ardan. Population Surplus. Excellent. I mean, yeah, it's kind of helpful. Yeah, I think they're going to take that settlement before I can get anywhere near it. So we will... Actually, because we're now just coming into their territory, we just might as well carry on going through. Carry on through until we're out. Which we are now. Excellent. Yeah, they're going to take Istros, but that's never been a Roman settlement. I'm not interested. You can take it. Until I come back and kill you all in like a couple of turns time. Because it's not allowed. Um, I'll go for auxiliary Germanic skirmishes because these guys are just cheapened. They'll be good enough for their job. I imagine they've got the same sort of thing. Yeah, they just got Germanic skirmishes. And they've got archers. Interesting. And they have Germanic spears. Is this their king? Did that say their king? <gasps> we could get their king. Kill him. Okay. Um, and we've got a few other things that happened. Excellent. Right. Um, your Africana, you're no longer needed here. Actually, no, you are. You're needed up here to defend against this army. I probably actually could have just... Right, if I just, like, stand there, you can't get me. You gotta go around. You could reach on a normal march and take that settlement back, I have a feeling. Especially since I've just taken it, so it's garrison is awful. Um Abusus, you can just get like I don't know. Get a meat in place. That'll be fine. Um and you can get a procreator's thingy. Then we'll get a harbour. You can do that. We could merge certainly these units. Actually, certainly those two. I'll merge these two and then I will get another one to replace it. Excellent. That'll be... That's easier. Um, it depends where they go... At, where the Vandali go after. If they go straight for a Quincum... Can I reach Quincum in one turn? I don't think I can. And Sermium is very much under threat then. Why are you still such low income? Corruption is so high. I'm trying to sort it out, dude, okay? I'm trying. Um, Vigilates Urbani. They can have. Increases the uh, defense of here a bit better. That'll be good. Um... I imagine the Vandali will say no to a peace treaty. Actually, if I can, if I took that money back, I could probably get peace and, av and avoid losing stuff. And t personally, I'd rather have that. I'd rather have seven, a thousand. I'm just gonna go till it's like, yeah, there we go, there we go. Beautiful. We don't need we don't need war. We can bring back that legion. We can put it here in Istros. I'll have two small legions to defend these two regions. And that should be enough to put the uh, Vandali off invading for another odd turn. Um, I think that's it. So we actually no, we can move this legion. 
This Legion can now probably march on here and take it next turn. Unless we have... Where have you gone then? Oh, you're just raiding. And you probably can reach here quite easily. Oh, it's annoying. Actually, you block off. So if we go this way, we get you. I'm sorry I'm trespassing. It has to be done. Right, so you're there. Trevorum hopefully cannot be got now. Oh, we'll see. We'll see. Um, and then um, I think we're done. End the turn again. Excellent. Gallic Rome moving its things aground for one last turn, I'm, ho I'm hoping. And then it's dead. And then we can just deal with... Deal with other people. Egypt, you better not... Oh, boy. It's a siege we definitely can't win. Aurelian is needed somewhere else. Fight more Bactrians. How many... Well, not legions, but... A, the Bane of Rome, a good name. A good name. Appropriate name. Oh, God, Egypt. Pull, this legion's not even pulled back. It's just persisting on going through that. Right, prosperity? Religion. Um, we'll go with prosperity. Missing taxes and tyro condensis. I'm not surprised. And banditry somewhere else. Because apparently just like the world is doomed. Doomed. Jula. Um, this one gives a lot of food. Wine trader gives a lot of food. What's the squalor here like? It's okay. It's okay. Banditry would go up though. I don't really want banditry to go up. Oh, this one gives a lot. And it's not going to worry about banditry. So we'll do that. Um, now we need to go and fight back that army. Population surplus in like all these places. Nice. Army loss, settlement loss. I know. Faction encountered Axum. Ships built. Hey, and stuff like that. Brilliant. Now, Aurelian, do you have it in you to kill these men? One last time. Hopefully it's one last time. I mean, this is going to have to be my border for. I've just realized for where I should be defending. Unless they come through here. Well, I don't want to really build another Eastern Legion either. Karenna, our taxa is fairly defended. We'll build a food place here. Then we could build... An equites in our taxa, and then well, it's not equites, but is it? No cohort barracks. Build that there, and then we've got more than enough to defend against um, any like incoming eastern armies. I'd have thought we will move you here. I'm going to move that one because I imagine I'll have to fight that fort. Yep, an undefended Gallic Rome settlement. Excellent. So, 91, they die. Finally, is that gonna is that gonna give me like a pop up for when I kill Gallic Rome? I could subjugate them. Uh, Gallic Rome? No, no. It's just it's gonna give me a pop up when I kill like all of the like factions that I should have like killed off. I don't know. We'll find out. The Frankie? <gasps> no, 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 no. Go through here. Go through here. I don't want to cause more trespassing problems that have already been caused. So you can go like to here, you can then start to invade um, up here, and then we can push out the flipping Caledonia as well. They can go. And... Uh, you can stay around here in Norea, because actually, if we're going to push out the Alamani, then we want to be around here as well. You can build a... Hmm. 3-9. Oh, we've already got a thing, so we could put in... Temple. I'll put in a Procreators again. We're going to make this a very non-bandit world. It's already down to 20. Because of characters and other stuff as well. Um, what can we build? We could build a few units. Nothing interesting. Maybe just some uh, skirmishes they'll do. And then... Oh yes, we're going to have to do this 
this four battle. Oh, actually they all pull, they're gonna pull back, so this could just be a normal pitch battle. And I might fight this. Oh, it's actually very, very mm. Um maybe not. I might just let that let that slide. Oh yeah, this is my army with the Evocati. They're just really, really good. They just probably stomp on everything. And then you can just force march this way. And we'll go straight down here, Cordoba, Bora, Lissipo, and there is a place up here. Hopefully they don't come up there. But yes, we will do that. But that is the end of the episode, guys, I am afraid. Um, so we are going to have to call it a day there. We are doing very, very well. Um, Aurelian is going to have to deal with the Easterners again. So we are I won't name the, the title again, Eastern Surprise. We've already had that. Another Eastern Surprise. I'm really not learning from my... Um, my problems either. Taxes here really high. We probably want to uh, do something about that and probably like bring in some uh, like bonuses, the pluses and stuff like that and then maybe put I won't put an army in there, it's just a waste but I don't know. I have no idea. We'll do something about that. But anyway, yeah, we will have to end the episode here so I hope you liked this video and if you had, give the video a like um, subscribe if you're new around here. Everyone is welcome in the Papal Legion. And until next time, guys, it's uh, bye from me. I hope you enjoy.